This method can help answer key questions in the head and neck reconstruction field about computer-assisted design and modeling reconstruction of the maxilla. The main advantage of this technique is that CAD-CAM simulations are accessible to everyone. The implications of this technique extended toward a reconstructive surgery therapy, as these surgeries are typically performed using a freehand approach. After selecting the area of bone to be excised, make a large plane and place the plane on the border of the area for removal in the appropriate computer-aided design software. Continue to place more planes until the entire area for removal has been surrounded and select the vertices of the planes. Connect the plates by adjusting edges and faces of the planes in the edit mode to surround the area for removal. Then use a Boolean modifier to subtract the resectable solid from the facial bone to generate a shaved facial bone for the maxillary defect model. Boolean modifiers sometimes fail. If this happens, don't panic and try again. Next, place a fibula into the maxillary defect area and mark the fibula with one small green cube 8 cm distal to the fibular head and one small green cube 5 cm proximal to the lateral malleolus. For the maxilla, place red cubes for the identification of the reconstructed points. Using a parent setting in the object mode,